Okay, it's raining out and I'm bored. So I thought I'd do another one of these little videos. A couple years ago I saw a thing at the stumac.com website. They sell guitar parts, one of my favorite places. Anyway, it was called the Tone Right. What it did was vibrate the guitar to break it open so it will play nicer and sound better and stronger and louder. So anyway, I couldn't afford the 150 bucks at the time. So one night I was laying there in bed thinking what I could do and I remembered as a kid I had an aquarium and the dang pump was always so noisy I never had an aquarium again. So anyway, I went down to the pet store and I bought me a cheap little $12 aquarium pump. Here it is right here. Now, I'm going to take off these little knobbers. Okay. I'm going to take this sandpaper, my 80 grit sandpaper. I'm going to sand that down nice and level. Just where those knobs were. Okay, next. I'm going to take a half inch dowel. A little saw. Okay, and then we're going to take that dowel. Cut it into one inch pieces. Got three of those. Alright. I'm going to take these. I'm going to level off one side of it. A little level on the level. Okay. Ends up coming out like this. About five sixteenths of an inch thick. I want to also round off these edges and round off a little bit right there so it sticks on the strings. Just take it like this. See, so yeah, round that off, and that, round these edges off like that. It was real easy. I did this on my 6x48 belt sander over here because it's a lot quicker. I know most people won't have anything like that, but I got a bunch of tools. Make uh, my hands go hurt so bad if I use tools. So anyway, now I've got three of these. One, two, three. Now I'm going to take my device. I'm going to take my super glue. Take my super glue. You're also going to need some zip kicker. Zip kicker. Okay. So now here's my eyeball of the middle. Gonna put some super glue on there. Take my zip kicker, a little bit right on the edge of that. Pop that right down there. Get as level as you can right off the back, because that baby's gonna dry right now. Now I'm gonna take a caliper. You can use a tape measure too. I want seven six or thirteen sixteenths between each one from center to center. So make a mark there. Center of that. See there right to the center of this right here. Alright, take my super glue again, right on there like that, right on there like that. Alright, zip kicker. Okay, eyeball that right on there like that. There we go, more zip kicker. Okay, eyeball my line right there. Now, there we go. Now, since I'm doing this fast, I'm going to take my zip kicker. Make sure all that glue is nice and dry. Okay. Just junk away. Okay, now. Take my guitar. Set it here. Plug in the guitar, okay, now you can hear that, I'm going to set that right on here like so, there we go, now you can hear that, and I can feel it real good, all that getting ready to open up the pores of that top wood and the side woods, open it right up, get all them braces ready to roll, alright, also works on 
your ukulele. Now, you see how that came off? That's why we rounded the edges of these things. Pull them right out like that. There we go, right into the ukulele. Perfect. I can feel that buzzing like crazy. That's going to make that sucker sound good. See how? Easy in, easy out. All right. That's it. Happy picking. See you later. Trouble with the water. Ain't treating one another like they oughta. One more.